I have a list of underrated cities and Chicago has definitely made it. But before we get to that story, first, fixing up our home in Berlin, getting ready for an adventure. It's been so long since we've sightseen, since we've been with family, since we've just had a sense of yeah, excitement and newness. So we're so eager for this time with Gabe's family, which I am meeting for the first time in Chicago. And while I won't be partaking in this brisket, I will just say that Manoa's brisket is world famous because we've heard about it all the way to Germany. And as Gabe says, it was quite incredible. But not to worry, he made me my own smoked salmon, which was probably equally as good, but I'll never know. It's just beef mac and cheese. Wow. The sharp cheddar, Wait. all the good cheddar. And this is? Everything casserole. casserole. All the cheese, all the Midwest cheese. Yeah, you're in the Midwest. Oh, so this is the one. This is a <laughs> this is a staple diet. Your most flavored. These are gonna feel a little cleaner. Okay. And, uh, oh my gosh, I'm, I'm at odds. Yeah. You recommend this one though? I do. Okay, I did. here we go. Wow. No family trip is complete without getting all the family photos in. As if this meal wasn't amazing enough, we had Amanda's carrot cake for dessert, and I got to enjoy it with my new friend. Amanda co-owns a salon in a really cool part of Chicago, and we got to see her whole salon and meet the folks that work there. And I've never seen so many hair colors in my life. We spent the rest of that day exploring the city, visiting a farmer's market, having coffee, and grabbing Cuban lunch. What we got? We got Cuban food. Maduro. You want a Maduro? Double beans, like no Maduro? rice. Maduro. Some shrimp. Maduro. We got a Cuban sandwich going on here. Gabby's <laughs> getting his meat fix. By now, my crush on Chicago is well into maturity. And I've just fallen in love with the architecture and the space and it's just such a peaceful city. It's such a calm, historic, beautiful city. And whenever I come to the US, I crave a few things. One of them being Mexican or Latin food and the other being American style pancakes. days in the city we wanted to make sure of course to see the eye but or the bean it's not called the eye it's the bean but also we wanted to visit the Academy of Art which is supposed to be one of the best in the world and also has quite a significant painting so what is this so this is something in my family 
great, great Aunt Josephine's aunt. And uh, that is, I think her name is supposed to be Francesca, but we don't really know which one it is. Your great aunt is Francesca. Um, great, 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 great aunt. Wow, wow. Her sister. And who painted this? Renoir. Okay. By this point, I am just so energized by discovering a new city, by meeting new people, seeing familiar faces, eating food, wandering, exploring. It just feels so good. We spent the next couple of days doing things like an architecture boat tour, going to a spice shop, getting our COVID shot, which was amazing, and enjoying the rest of family time. And on our final night, we had a special family dinner, eating frutta di mari and learning how to make bruschetta. And that ends our time in Chicago.